Hi everybody, today I'm going to share with you an Aldi's haul and kind of show you how I am stocking up. I'm buying one or two extra things at a time and cutting them up, freezing them, or cutting them up, cooking them if they need to be cooked first, and then freezing them. So let's go over my haul. So I did go up and pick, uh, go ahead and get two dozen of eggs. They're holding steady at $4.99 for right now. So I definitely wanted to get a couple of those before they went up again. Now I did pick up some fresh fruit. It's a pound of strawberries for $2.49. I kind of had a dig to get a good package of these, but well worth it, I think. And some of them weren't a pound either, I can about guarantee. And then I did get a three pack of the peppers. They are $1.99. And some celery. The celery is $1.39. And then last time I was at Aldi's, they actually didn't have any baby carrots or any carrots. So I made sure to pick up two bags. And these were 95 cents each. And this is what I'm talking about. Because right here, I am going to freeze those and I'll have them down the road later so if they run out again and I'm going to try the same thing with the eggs so wish me luck on freezing the eggs now I did pick up some more Colby Jack cheese slices I like the more natural cheese and I'm also going to freeze those they freeze well they're $1.89 that's the regular price in my area it has been for the last mm, couple of years so I did get those and then what else did I get? I decided to pick up a coffee creamer even though I don't need it because it does not expire until January or January until July of 23 and that was 265 and then I did find these cookies that you'll you'll probably see on a short but anyways they were 97 cents a piece so my total came to 2612 but here's the thing about the cookies i can take these i can do so many things with these right now i don't care that they look like christmas cookies right now uh i can have a couple eat them just like this i can put them in something else or freeze them if i want to use them for valentine's day i need to freeze them now but when i take them out of the freezer i can refrost them and like red frosting or pink I, there's so many different options you can do. So I know I saved over $2 per pack on cookies. Do I need them now? Nope. So I will be taking them out of these containers and popping them in my freezer. So that is the end of my haul. And this is what $30, under right under $30 gets you. But $10 of it about was eggs. So I hope you guys enjoyed my video. If you have not subscribed yet, please hit the subscribe button and the thumbs up. It just helps my videos get out there to more people and it helps me out with, of course, YouTube. So I hope you all are blessed and having a great day. I'll see you on my next one. Carmen out.